right, 521 this morning. We're just 43 days out from the 2020 Tokyo Olympics. That's right. And you will be able to watch all the 41 action, all the action right here on 41 Action News. We got it. There's a lot of action. <laughs> Beginning July 23rd. Here at 41 Action News, we are watching <laughs> all of our local athletes, swimmers, gymnasts, runners to see if they'll make it to qualify for the games. 41 Action News reporter Jordan Betts joins us live outside the gym of two local gymnasts who earned their spot at the Olympic trials in St. Louis on June 25th. This is pretty exciting, Jordan. Yeah, this is very exciting. Kara Aker and Leanne Wong are very excited. They're headed to St. Louis for the Olympic trials. But they're going to have to take all that excitement now and putting it into their training. And let me tell you, they have a lot of training to do. I got to catch up with the girls on Tuesday. Um, they had just gotten off the flight the night before as they came back from Fort Worth after championships. And they are they were back into the gym getting ready for the Olympic trials. Um, now let's talk about how they qualified for this. Now, the Leanne got fifth last weekend while Kara played placed in 10th. Now those qualified them for the champ this, for the Olympic trials. And so for the next two weeks, these women will be doing two a days. Yes, you heard that right. Two a days, perfecting every move in all of their routines. Continue training, um, nothing too crazy, just working on the like the minor details. These next few weeks, we're just gonna train as hard as we can and improve as much as we can mm -hmm. in order to be at our peak and just be ready to perform well at the Olympic trials. I love how Kara just says, oh, nothing too crazy. Nothing too crazy. You're headed to the Olympic trials doing two a days. I'm already out of breath just talking about that this morning. But these girls have been at an elite level for several years, so they can handle this. And you can watch the Olympic trials here on 41 Action News. Guys? All right, Jordan, we love that. There were three Gage Center athletes that competed this weekend. So what can you tell us about that third gymnast? Yeah, that would be Aaliyah Finnegan. Unfortunately, yeah. she did not qualify. She got 23rd place overall. We'd love to see her go, but unfortunately, she did not qualify. Here's her, what her coach had to say about her this weekend. She's wonderful, and not everybody can make it. I mean, in, in this great sport of ours, there's always going to have to be people who are going to be left behind. Mm -hmm. But she gave it 110% the whole time. And, you know, it broke everybody's heart, but we all go on. And she's the biggest supporter of these two girls going forward. But this isn't the end of her gymnastics career. She will be going to LSU, where she will be on the gymnastics team. So congratulations to her, guys. Yes, go Tigers. That's exciting. <laughs> <laughs> well, both Leanne and Kara are from the gym competing <laughs> at the trials together, correct? Correct. That is correct. What a team bonding experience. I mean, not a lot of people can say, oh, you know, I've been to Olympic trials. No big deal. These girls can do it together and kind of rely on each other going through something that not a lot of people say they've done. Pretty great. Jordan, thank you very much for joining thank us this morning live. So as we said, they're both from the same gym competing at that trials together. They told us about how it makes them more comfortable going into the competition, being together rather than alone, too. I'm so thankful that she's going to be there with me that I don't have to like just knowing that she's going to be there through it all with me and just we get to do it together. It's just yeah. one of those like just kind of really bonding experiences. Um, it's really exciting to have two of us going to the Olympic trials so that we can train together and help each other along. Mm -hmm. And just when we're going out to compete, it feels like we're practicing at home since we have our teammates with us. Practicing at home. Competing for a spot on the Olympic team is not easy, of course, especially since only six women will make it to Tokyo to represent Team USA. Kara and Leanne are two of 18 who will be competing at the Olympic trials. So here's how the final selections are made. The U.S. qualified a four-person team by winning gold in the team, even at the even at the 2018 World Championships. The first spot goes to first place in the all-around at the trials, most likely Simone Biles, who yeah. hasn't lost an all-around competition since 2013. Yeah, go ahead and lock that in. <laughs> second spot goes to second place in the all-around. The third and fourth spots are selected by the committee. So there are two individual Olympic spots. They are still part of the U.S. team, but won't be allowed to compete in the team event. The first spot will go to Jade Carey, who clinched the spot during the 2018-2020 World Cup Series. The second spot is selected by a committee.